In this video, I'm going to show you how you can tag products in your Facebook and Instagram posts to drive free traffic from Instagram and Facebook to your website. It's free traffic, so it's a no-brainer. So how does this look on Instagram? Here's an Instagram account for Hello Baby. If we click on an image, we can see the items which have been tagged on that photo and also other items from the shop. If, there's, if we then click through, we can actually see those products on the actual website where they can be purchased. And I scroll down and have another look at a reel. If we click on that reel, we can see the items which are in that reel. They've all been tagged and also other items which are in the shop. Now let's take a look at how this looks on Facebook. If, again, if we scroll down, we can see the different posts. If we click on a post, which says shop photo, we can then see the items which are available in that photo. So there we have the, the items available. Let's scroll down and see another post. There's the reel. Uh, there's another post. If we just click on the earmuffs again, which we saw earlier, we can see again, there's a link at the bottom. If we click through to that link, then we get to the shop where we can purchase the item. Now we know what the post looked like, let's look at how we can link Shopify and Facebook so we can get our product data from Shopify into our Facebook account and start tagging products. The easiest and cheapest way to push up data from your Shopify store to Facebook is to use the Facebook app in Shopify. You can find this from the Shopify app store. So for Facebook, it's this one here, Facebook and Instagram. Free to install and it's made directly by Meta. So you go through the process of installing this. Once you've installed the app, return to Shopify and go to Sales Channels and you'll find Facebook and Instagram. Now I'm going to show you the process of connecting your Shopify store with your Facebook and Instagram accounts. So I've gone to the app, I'm going to click Get Started, and we're going to go through the process of setting up the shop. So the first thing to do is to connect the Facebook account. So it's just going to log me in as me. Then you'll see the different assets you have here. I'm going to click my, connect my Vendlab Facebook page and my Instagram account. Let's just connect those. It's going to ask us about data sharing. So I'm going to choose maximum because we want to send the most data from Shopify to Facebook to get the best performance. So connect a data set to track customer behavior. So, so this is adding the tracking to Shopify. So in, fa in future, if you do any Facebook advertising, you can do the tracking. Let's just connect that. I'm going to agree. And then we're all done. And what we've done now is we're connected to Shopify and Facebook. And so the product data from Shopify will go into your Facebook account where you can use it to tag products on Facebook and Instagram. On the right-hand side, we can under connected product catalog, if we click that, we can see that the product catalog is connected. Now within our inventory, we need to select the products that we're gonna push over to Facebook. So if we go to products and we click into a product, What we need to do is go to the publishing section and we need to manage the sales channels this is getting pushed up to. So you can see here that this is being pushed up to all channels, including Facebook and Instagram. This can be done in bulk. So first, if we select the products we want to do, so let's select all the products in this store. So we've selected all of them. And then we click bulk edit on the right hand side. And then if we go to columns and then choose Facebook and Instagram, that shows us this column here, which has all the products in it. And if we can go through and we can see, we can select them all in one go. The only other thing we need to do from within Facebook is to set the shipping. So if we go into settings, all these things have already been set apart from the shipping and it's got a processing time defaulted to three days here. If we click change, then we can change the processing times um, and you can change your processing time and also set custom delivery dates. Now that we've linked Shopify and Facebook, Let's look at how we create tagged posts in Facebook. So how do you create posts on Facebook and Instagram which are tagged with your products? So I've logged into my Facebook account here and that's this account has access to a number of other business accounts. So I can select these from the top right hand corner and I'm going to select Hello Baby. Then if I go into the Meta Business Suite, I can post to both Instagram and Facebook at the same time. So if I click Create a Post, you can see it's posting to Facebook and Instagram, and I can select both or one of those. So if I choose to share a photo, let's just upload a photo. I select this picture of headphones. I can then tag that using this option here. If I search for bands, it's gonna pick up these infant hearing things. And if I save that, then when that's posted, it'll be tagged with that product that we've seen previously. So we'd fill in this information here. You can set a scheduling option and publish it.